Criminology Board Exam Reviewer Juvenile Delinquency Youthful Offender He is over 9 years old but under 18 years old at the time of the commission of the offense. Crime Theories Applicable to Juvenile Delinquency 1. Rational Choice Causes of crime lie within the individual offender rather than in their external environment. 2. Social disorganization, absence or breakdown of communal institutions and communal relationships that traditionally encouraged cooperative relationships among people. 3. Strain theory, crime is caused by the difficulty of those in poverty in achieving socially valued goals by legitimate means. 4. Differential association, young people are motivated to commit crimes by delinquent peers and learn criminal skills from them. 5. Labeling theory, once a person is labeled criminal they are more likely to offend. Once labeled as deviant, a person may accept that role and more likely to associate with others who have been similarly labeled. 6. Social control theory proposes that exploiting the process of socialization and social learning builds self-control and can reduce the inclination to indulge in behavior recognized as antisocial. Communal institutions. 1. Family. 2. School. 3. Church. 4. Social groups. 4 types of control that can help prevent juvenile delinquency. 1. Direct, punishment is threatened or applied for wrongful behavior and compliance is rewarded by parents, family and authority figures. 2. Internal, youth refrains from delinquency through the conscience or superego. 3. Indirect, by identification with those who influence behavior because his, her delinquent act might cause pain and disappointment to parents and others with whom he, she has close relationships. 4. Control, through needs satisfaction, if all individuals' needs are met, there is no point in criminal activity. Breed vs. Jones. It is a U.S. court decision where it held that juveniles cannot be tried when acquitted in juvenile court then tried again in adult criminal court. Double jeopardy applies to juveniles as well as adults. Juvenile delinquency. It is the participation in illegal behavior by minors who fall under a statutory limit. Juvenile delinquent. He is a person who is typically under the age of 18 and commits an act that otherwise would have been charged as a crime if they were an adult. Crimes commonly committed by juvenile delinquents. 1. Status offenses, is an action that is prohibited only to a certain class of people and most often applied to offenses only committed by minors. Example, underage smoking. 2. Property crimes, is a category of crime that includes theft, robbery, motor vehicle theft, arson, shoplifting and vandalism. 3. Violent crime in which the offender uses or threatens to use violent force upon the victim. Age of majority. It is the threshold of adulthood as it is conceptualized, recognized or declared by law. The vast majority of country including the Philippines set majority age at 18. Young adult. He is a person between the ages of 20 and 40 whereas adolescent is a person between the ages of 13 and 19. Truancy. It is any intentional unauthorized absence from compulsory schooling. Vandalism. It is the ruthless destruction or spoiling of anything beautiful or venerable. The term includes criminal damage such as graffiti and defacement directed towards a property without the permission of the owner. Graffiti. It is writing or drawings scribbled, scratched or sprayed illicitly on a wall or other surface in a public place defacement. It refers to marking or removing the part of an object designed to hold the viewer's attention. Types of offenders that emerge in adolescence. Repeat offender, life course persistent offender, begins offending or showing antisocial, aggressive behavior in adolescence or even childhood and continuous in adulthood. Age-specific offender, adolescence-limited offender, 
juvenile offending or delinquency begins and ends during their period of adolescence.